All right, so we're going to now um, use Postman to um, actually go through. Now, we've done the first one, which is the server origin, um, which is good to try. Um, and um, so, yeah, try that. But then also start going on through. There's here we, these pictures that are coming up in the screen here. So this is the web page that I'm looking at now. So I'm just putting that in the chat. And oops, let me hit return. And I'm putting it in the Dojo Live channel as well. You can see it. Um, on that page, there are some um, different types of errors that you might get with Postman. Uh, but really, what you're you're starting to do is you're going to um, uh, you're actually going to start configuring the platform itself. So at the moment, it's coming up in a, a fairly unsecured state. Um, and we'll get, you're going to set up the security connector and the configuration connector. Um, and uh, the here are the detailed instructions. You just follow the links, and then it will tell you exactly what you're doing. And you'll find that if you look at the admin services have three groups of collections. And one of them is called the admin services platform configuration. And in there are all the requests that are mentioned in these pages. So this one, configuration document store, you'll see set configuration document store. So, so the, the request should be there, but look at the, the details, look at the, um, look at the uh, particularly look. So this is, so the, the REST API has a URL, but for typically for the posts, if you click on body, that is the main parameters. That's like the, the, the bulk of the information that's going to be passed. And it's written in JSON typically and um, uh, have a look have a look at the instructions and make sure the content of this body is correct as well as the URL at the top. And make sure these variables are set to the right values for the request you're making. At this stage, most things are set correctly, but as you go on through the um, tutorials, you'll find that um, you'll need to go in and change the variables as you're going. So I will leave you to the pleasures of configuring the OMAG server platform. And uh, as I say, if anyone's got any questions or we find another bug for us, which will be great, um, uh, let us know. <laughs>